clock is finished. Thank you, John, for the new spindle. Thank you, EJ, for coming up to the house several times to help get the damn thing ready to work. Here, come along the side here. So, got to still make this crank, but watch what watch the maintenance gearing when I spin this. You see, it will uh, it will not unload the mechanism as it's turned, meaning it'll still spin. But look what happens underneath. There is a takes 140 pounds to run this clock. There you go. Now, it's very simple. It's very simple. It's just a whole bunch of reductions, or uh, the opposite of reductions, overdrives, to the final shaft. You've got a speed governor, right? And I'll, I'll have to take a little, I'll take a photo and superimpose it, but those, those uh, fly balls have little cork brake shoes in them, which I had to fix, because those are all screwed up. They bear on this brake pad here to regulate the speed. And then the final drive shaft is, I think, three reductions down, and that's what drives your lens. In this case, we have about a 3,000th order, uh, because, of course, we don't have enough money to actually get a third order here and hook it up to the thing. Uh, but it's a pretty good representation of what's going on there. Hold it at the focal height there so you get the, the, uh, the full effect. Strangely enough, that model's a replica of the second order lens in Boston Light. So, just thought, thought everyone would be interested to see that. But yeah, so this is now going to go to the owner of Graves Point Light, probably going to go in the lighthouse. Don't know what it's going to do there because it's not powerful enough to drive the first order that we put in um, together. But this movement, I believe, is a Bernard Barbier and Turenne. Um, but yeah, that's it. Maybe film it from a few other angles, and then maybe a maybe distance a, shot. Uh, I don't think so. All right, well. How's your lighting? You need more light? No, actually, this is fine. Okay, good, yeah, because I hate those fluorescents. <clears throat> oh. going to wind it up again. Cuts the lights off. And like I say, make sure you get it from the focal height. Mm -hmm. And then another way at a distance. Take all kinds of shots of it. 